What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So today we got a really small update in my restaurant. It was only adding a couple new items and there's like a quest and whatever. But the reason that this update was so small is because next week we're getting a huge update. It's a prestige update. We might be getting like diamonds or something like that as well to go with trading. But next week is going to be a huge update. I think it's May 12th. But today we got a really small update and I had a quest. It's kind of cool. So if you see on the bottom here, I have 4,850 customers out of five that of the five thousand so we only need 150 more so in about another minute or so we're gonna go and we're gonna finish the quest but in this video i'm gonna be showing you the fastest way to get this quest this took me just over an hour i would say and i don't have a customer layout at all this layout is good for money but i don't really have that much money right now either because i haven't really been grinding recently like, i don't think i've joined this game since the last update so before we go and collect our new i think it's a cactus sombrero or something like that i forgot the exact name of it but like i said the update dropped about an hour ago we have a hundred more customers left to serve and you can already tell you can see all these bells here basically this is what we're going to be doing to get more customers really fast i'll explain it all after we get the after we get our you know our customers in the hundred more in the update they also added the shop back which i liked i'm not sure if this was just me i'm not sure if anyone else feels the same way about it but i didn't like when the shop was like a what's it called a ui on the bottom of the screen i liked when there was an actual shop and it's really cool we need 40 more customers so that should happen any any second now so there's 600 for the golden sombrero cactus. You can, if you want to pay 600 to go trade for it, you can. And then this is a limited time pinata. So if you want to go buy this, it's not going to be available after next week. But it doesn't do anything. It's just a decorative piece. And then in here, they have... Oh, and here we have the tables and chairs. I like how they add the customers uh, on what's called the customers like on the display. I think that's really cool. I have here the alien, and then these are still Robux. I think is 1,200, 800 Robux. Right, and here we go. 5,000 out of 5,000 customers. Like I said, this only took about an hour because there's a certain strategy that I was using that I'm going to show you in a second. Let's go here, click E, wow, Kukayev was taken, that was fast, as I promised, here's your sombrero cactus, and I would assume it's in my inventory now, and yeah, because he just disappeared, so there's no more, no more quests in this update, let's see here, and we did get it, alright, so let's go back to my restaurant, let's just put it on a random floor, we'll put it here, actually, no, I don't want to put it on this floor, let's put it here, build, alright, it's in decor, right, go here, and then we'll add it. Now, what I believe this does is gives a 5% chance of getting a Sombrero customer into your shop, which is pretty cool. I think they give only 5% or 10% more. I think it's 5% more cash. I'm not exactly sure about that. So I believe that if they have a Sombrero on, the customers pay five times more, which I thought was 5% more. It's five times more. That's actually crazy. And I think that the one you get for doing the quest is 5% chance of getting a Sombrero customer. And this one is a 10% chance. So the money you get is the same for each one. It's just you get it more often with the golden one. So if you want to spend 600 Robux for it, go for it. I mean, it's definitely worth it. I think it's worth it, actually. 600, it's not that bad. It's going to be worth a lot if you want. You could buy this and maybe trade them for some royal sets. That's not the point of this video. Really quickly, I'm going to show you the best way to get 5,000 customers really fast. Now, there is no way to really rush this because I believe this event is going to be on for a week. It's going to be on until next week and it might even go past next week. If you want to do it fast, you want to get it, you know, as fast as possible. Again, I have a really good layout, but this layout is meant for money. It's not really meant for customers. Put down some gingerbread tables and chairs just because the gingerbread code, the elf customers, they come in a lot faster and they eat a lot faster so you can get more customers in at once. That's kind of the point of all these bells, right? So here's what we're going to do to get customers really fast, okay? So see, I have all of these bells right here. What you're going to want to do is buy as many bells as possible. Fill up flo entire floors if you can. Going to go here. You want to kind of click E, and then you're going to want to wait about like 20 seconds and then click another one. Now these stack, remember, so you can get as many as you want and then wait about 20 seconds between each bell and just press them. And you're going to notice, like, I don't have the, the thing down here, so I can't really see how fast my customers are coming in. But these, it's going to be crazy fast, trust me. So this one's been about 20 seconds, so go press the next one. And then another 20 seconds, we're going to keep pressing them. I have a ton up here. And then if we come up here, I also have some bells. Oh, this also, I feel like this is obvious. I didn't really say anything, but you know, I might as well just say it since I'm here. Make sure you use your wells as well. I have 20 hours on these, 6 hours on these, and 2 hours left on this. And then you're going to want to use this as well. The only reason this is like good, I guess, is because you want the advert. What's it called? What's this called again? I forgot what it's called. The advertiser something. Uh, advertising campaign or rush hour if it's like it's the exact same thing but it's two different names for some reason that's really the only one that you want so if you can get rush hour or advertiser campaign out of all of these that's really the only one you need 
So this one is about to hit 20 seconds here. Let's go press another one. And you're just going to want to do this every single time. So I'm going to finish these. Now, you don't want to you don't want to press them all at once. That's something you don't want to do. You want to wait about 20 to 30 seconds in between pressing each bell. But just for the sake of it, I'm going to go press every single one really fast. And then I'm going to go buy a bunch of more bells. Where are they in the shop? They're only 120k, so they're not that much. Let's go here. I believe they're in decor, right? About 13. So let's just put them out. And all the numbers flicking on my screen is starting to get my game a little laggy. This is getting my game more laggy than actually having like real customers in the store. So you're going to want to come here, press E, wait about, like I said, 20 seconds, press it again. You're going to get, okay, my voice chat is on. That's weird. And that's the fastest way to do it. You could fill up your entire restaurant with bells. Obviously, it's going to get a little expensive. You know, like this is 120K per bell. So if you don't have like millions and millions and millions, you might not be able to do this. But if you have a decent amount, like even if you just have a few million, you want to spend some on bells. Again, it's probably not worth it because you guys have the entire week to get 5,000 customers. 5,000 customers in a week is not that hard. Like you had a week to get, it was, it was 100,000 100, customers for the Big Cat event. So 5,000 customers is nothing. But this is just if you want to get it really fast, you can do this method or this isn't even for this event. If you just want to get customers fast in general, you can put a bunch of bells out and do this. You'll get them, like I said, really fast if you want to grind for the leaderboard or something like that. But that's really it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video and peace.